I'm here at Urban Gallery for the launch of the October show, and I'm with photographic artist Robert Brody. How are you, Robert? I'm good. I'm happy the day has finally arrived. Yeah. Stop hanging on the wall. And I've been looking around. There's some beautiful pieces here, and the colors are so rich and concentrated. And um, I wanted to know, how long have you been taking photographs? Wow. I, Ever since you were little? <laughs> yeah, since I was six. My parents uh, took me to uh, Kenya, and uh, when I was six, I bought my first Kodak Instamatic, and I, I took many, many rolls of film, and after that, I just decided that like, this is what I love to do. So. What's fabulous. Um, a lot of your uh, photographs are very rich in color, yeah. and... Uh, and uh, there's also some, some amazing landscapes I'm going to look at shortly. Um, what's your favorite? Portraits of people or landscapes? Do you have any yeah. preference? I think for me, I think it depends on the, on, the, on the moment because, you know, if you're in the open desert and you're looking at sky and earth, mm -hmm. that's, that's the, the sum total. And then if a human being happens to be walking in that desert, and it's very organic. Like over here, we have uh, Mohammed, and yeah. you know, I met him um, in the Moroccan desert, and so, you know, he is from the desert. That, yeah. That's his home. Yeah, it's a he's very beautiful. beautiful that yeah. very natural thing to photograph him in his environment. So yeah. there's a whole series of portraits with him, in, um, with his motorcycle, with his camels, and uh, for me, it's just it's just capturing the essence of a moment, whether it's a person or. A, a landscape. Wonderful. Can we walk over here? Because I'm fascinated with the you are here. Yes. So can you explain to me what that is? Okay, well that's a, that's a four by four. Yeah. Uh, so this is in the Salar de Uyuni in, the, uh, in Bolivia. Oh. And it's a salt flat. So it actually looks like it's snow, but it's, it's salt. And, um, and that is a, a little four by four oh. SUV. Crossing the end, so I happened to find a, a high point, and uh, and it just the landscape just opened up. And My gosh! So staggering. Yeah. yeah. Isn't that fascinating? That is great. And this other piece here, this is beautiful. Where was this taken? Yeah, this was taken in uh, Switzerland, uh, right near the uh, Eiger, and uh, so it's the Alps. Yep. And that's uh, Lake Thun, which uh -huh. is just near uh, Interlaken. Uh, and that was just taken last year, actually, when I was there. For, it's beautiful. It was like a moment that everybody waits for. Yes, absolutely. <laughs> yeah, it rained, and then it stopped raining, and it rained again, and I just kept running out from dinner and dropping my cutlery and running back into the photograph. <laughs> start to rain, and run back and eat. And, well, yeah, that's so. great. And then these, these are two images that are really interesting. You've got the, the temple men, the, the holy men there, and then down here you've got this very zen like black and white of a lily pond. Yes. Can you tell me the stories behind these two? Yeah, so, so this is uh, Pashupadina, um, and that's a Hindu temple just outside of uh, downtown Kathmandu. Wow. And uh, so right, right on this side, there's a river actually where they burn uh, the bodies. Uh, right. So, um, so it's a very kind of intense, very holy city for, for the Hindus. And then um, uh, down here is a, a a uh, still life that I uh, shot in uh, Colombia and Amazon. Wow, so, yeah. Uh, so it, old world and new world. Yes, exactly. Yeah. And, and it's just that idea of, of uh, you know, you have this Amazon which is just wild and everything is grand scale and then you can narrow your lens and you find these little precious moments, these precious places oh, it's uh, of stillness. So if we wanted to explore no, more of your work, do you have a website? Yep, you could go to www.cloudgazer.com. Fantastic. Well, the show runs here at Urban Gallery in Toronto till the end of the month, and I encourage everybody to come out and see Robert's work. It's beautiful. Thank you very much. Good luck with the show.